Hello, my name is Dr. Mark Burdard. I'm a board certified chiropractic neurologist in Scottsdale, Arizona. Uh, today I'd like to share with you a little uh, clinical gem that I signed, actually really a science project that I did on myself. And if you followed me on any social media for a while here, I'm always talking about you should be taking vitamin D. And ideally, you should get your blood work tested and your vitamin D levels should be between 50 and 70. So I do my blood work every year annually and on June 27th of 19, I had my vitamin D level tested. And you can see on the screen as well as on, on this uh, posting that my vitamin D level is 64.9. So you know, essentially it was 65 and it's between that 50 and 70. So I had my uh, annual blood work done again on July 8th of 20 here and my vitamin D level came in at 51.4, okay? Now, I have been seeing patients since day one of all this, and I usually take 10,000 international units. I'm uh, 205 pounds, so that was giving me a good range at 64.9. And actually, when all this started back in uh, you know, April and May, I was taking 30, 40,000 units a day. And even through June, I still was taking 20,000 units a day. So how did the, my numbers from 65 go down to 51? Well, one big thing is called stress, okay? And we've all been in a serious amount of stress. We can't go to the gym as an exercise as much as we can. And actually, I've been out in the sun even more, you know, in the last couple of months, and still it dropped. So stress will lower your vitamin D, which means it's all the more reason to take more vitamin D. And obviously, I'm gonna tell you to always test and you can retest it. I think sometimes people just have a hard time wrapping it around their head, but um, the analogy I'm gonna give you is, you know, if you have a car that basically gets uh, 10 uh, gallons in its tank and it gets 20 miles to the gallon, then you can probably drive 200 miles before you run out of gas. And if you're not checking your vitamin D and if you're not taking vitamin D, you're gonna be depleted. So I'm somebody that actually checks my, uh, my body's levels. It's like, I feel sorry for the people that don't. So I hope this is a message for you to be more proactive with your life. And you see the, the half-life of vitamin D is 15 days. So a good idea would be to get tested, retest in maybe 30 or 45 days, and then see, are you in that healthy range, which is 50 to 70. So closing thoughts, go, know, take control of your life because it is your life. Everybody have a great day. Bye-bye.